Hi, Chris. This is Dave from Jersey. I'm a subscriber. I love your show. My question is, when is the way in which miners sell and profit from precious metals going to be unhooked from this COMEX travesty? And what other mechanisms are there out there to replace COMEX? It seems that this, this is a system that just can't sustain itself. The cat's really out of the bag. It seems they've really exposed who and what they are, if there was any question really, uh, based on the action over the past week. I also have a comment because I'm fascinated by both investing in and studying the Bible. In Genesis 2, there's what seems to be sort of an offhand remark about gold. It says the gold in the land of Havilah is very good, which uh, is pretty interesting since the other things that are described as good are no less than light and the things created on the several days of creation. So here you've got God defining inherent value Unless anyone think that that's a casual observation, if you look at the very end of the book of the Bible, you're going to see what everyone just knows as the mark of the beast, where what happens with inherent value? Inherent value is no longer any good for anything unless human authority says it, that you have permission to use it according to their rules. That's in Revelation 13. In Revelation 6, we also have wages, basically limited to a denarius for a quart of wheat, which is a day's wage. So God apparently doesn't like price fixing, either in labor, in people's blood, sweat, and tears, or in things like gold. So this system obviously should take note that one day that temple is going to be cleansed, true value is going to find its justification in an honest system. Thanks, guys, for a great show. Take care.